The top 10 3D printed creations edition number three. At number 10, a 3D printed drone, raking the world record for being the largest and fastest 3D printed drone. It has a 10 foot wingspan and it can go up to 150 miles per hour or 241 kilometers per hour. It achieves this great speed by having a jet engine and incorporating a hollow but rigid structure, which allows the drone to be aerodynamic and light. The drone weighs about 30 pounds and some of the parts were even fused together, so the aircraft was not built in one print. The one benefit of these types of drones is that they can be built in less than half the time of ordinary drones. At number 9, a titanium vertebrae implant. An older patient suffered from a cancer which grew on his two top vertebrae, threatening to paralyze him for the rest of his life. It would have been very difficult to replace the bone from another part of his body due to the amount of precision involved. But thanks to a perfect 3D printed replica, the patient is now fully recovering. And it's just another example of 3D printing helping out someone in need, which I think is really cool. At number 8, a 3D map of New York. Featuring an intricate map of Manhattan, the model includes hundreds of offices, apartments, cafes, restaurants, and even historical buildings. The whole set is less than one meter long and it would be perfect to play Godzilla on, but it would cost over $25,000 to buy the model. CAD models of each individual building were made using 3ds Max, Rhino, and Adobe. Each model was then 3D printed with acrylic and glow in the dark filament, making a unique replica of the real city. The talented artist has even created 3D models of Hong Kong, Rome, and even Venice. At number 7, a dragonfly ornithopter. One day you're gonna have your own autonomous insect, and thanks to Tonga University, we are definitely one step closer to this reality. Thanks to a thorough study of the real life counterpart, the remote controlled insect can fly in any direction and even hover. Simplified components are 3D printed and assembled to make one of the smallest flying machines ever created. It is roughly 15 grams and has a 15 centimeter wingspan, but don't worry, it does not have a mini spy camera as of yet. But the team is working on more advanced versions of this flying machine. At number 6, a scorpion robot. This brilliant design imitates a real life scorpion which stabs and kills you. And hopefully the creators did not include the deadly toxin, or we might just have the ultimate killing machine. The printed parts include mechanical components, the leg connections, and even that eerie jabbing tail. The Hexopod robot has an autonomous mode where it can interact with its environment. Thanks to its onboard sensors and deadly programming, the robot can detect and stain people in close proximity. And if I treat this robot right and convince a little killer I'm its friend, I'm sure I'll live for another day. At number 5, the Star Destroyer Computer. Built by a talented Dutch modder, the computer case took over two years to assemble, and the project even won the grand prize from an MSI competition. Aside from the laser cut frame and the blinking lights, everything beyond that was 3D printed. It has a 6600K processor, 32 gigs of RAM, along with a 780Ti Lightning card. And if I ever own this thing, I'll outfit it with some powerful laser turrets and some mini flying starfighters. And it will become the greatest computer mod of all time. At number 4, the Scarlett Johansson Robot. The thing I like about this robot is that 70% of it was 3D printed, and it was designed and built by one person. It's a clever imitation and shows a controversial vision of making robot copies of real life people. It took over a year and $50,000 to get the prototype working, and it only has a set of program verbal commands. But my favorite concept about humanoid robots is that maybe you can entirely print your own one day, which is kind of cool but a little bit scary at the same time. At number 3, the largest polymer building. 3D printed buildings are quickly changing the landscape and this project shows the potential about off the grid living. The 450 square foot shell is made from high strength insulated materials and is powered from solar panels embedded in the roof. But what makes the project really neat is that a retrofitted vehicle can add additional wireless power to the house. The house was built by many key industry leaders to showcase affordable housing while cutting down construction and material waste. And I'll probably buy one of these units if it ever gets wheels. At number 2, Meteorite Metal. This is one of my favorite achievements since we finally built the first 3D printed object, which is made from a meteorite. The company Planetary Resources took material from a meteorite which landed in Argentina and fed it through a direct laser metal 3D printer. Now the object itself is not really revolutionary, but it does resemble a strong vision of utilizing materials from outer space, instead of trying to build everything on Earth and launching it into orbit. It would dramatically cut billing costs and would ultimately help humanity take the first steps into colonizing space, and possibly even other planets. At number 1, the Rutherford Rocket Engine. There have been a few partially 3D printed rocket engines, but this particular one is my favorite. All of the primary components of the combustor and propellant supply have been 3D printed. It already has been tested for over 2 minutes producing 5,000 pounds of force. And the end goal is to use 9 of these engines on a rocket capable of sending the 150 kilogram payload into orbit. And if all goes well, the new building process will dramatically reduce the cost of building rockets. Now I do think multi-material 3D printers will eventually build entire engines. And it might even make space travel affordable to everyone. And perhaps one day it might even be possible to entirely 3D print your own rocket. 
And once again, thanks for watching. Please like the video and subscribe to my channel for more cool tech videos.